left to vote on the governor's proposal. Governor Parson wants to spend millions of dollars to help ease Missouri's child care crisis. For almost a year, On Your Side has highlighted the problems and possible solutions to help more families get access to good child care. Ashley Reynolds has tonight's update. Lisa, just to recap, whether you have kids or not, it's a problem that impacts all of us. It's part of the worker shortage. Parents stay home with their kids because they cannot find or they cannot afford child care. Well, today, community leaders gathered to put pressure on lawmakers to get the job done. Adults who don't get quality support on early education when they start out are more likely to be involved in bad behavior and criminal behavior, and it's something I absolutely see. Child advocates say it starts by investing now, not babysitting, but good quality child care for all Missouri kids. And it's nutrition, it's education, it's physical activity, it's some structure for them. It improves outcomes, and, and that will pay dividends in the future as far as what their behavior looks like. <laughs> The plan is to invest $78 million to help our child care crisis. That means tax credits for child care providers, increased child care subsidy rates for parents, and better pay for child care workers. There are plans to expand free kindergarten options for low-income children. Early this week, we told you nearly one quarter of Springfield kids were not prepared for kindergarten. That's a significant gap that we can close if, uh, if we put some money into it. We see in our, in our child care facilities, we see so many families struggle. Um, to afford tuition, to find quality child care. A lot of times we have to turn families away just because our, our spots are all full and we often don't have any other um, places that we can refer them to just because spaces are so limited. Leaders with the Council for a Strong America, Mission Readiness and Fight Crime Invest in Kids gathered for a final push to get this passed. We certainly hope that the, the governor's proposal gets passed. That's just, that's just the start of, of, of things to come. So the matter passed the House and moves on to the Senate. On Your Side will continue to follow this and help find solutions for a child care crisis. Steve? No, it's